Hi guys, as you just read uh, at our thumbnail, in this video we will tell you about 5 of the best android phones you can't buy, whether it's because of location or other problems. In these 5 android phones, number 1 is Xiaomi Mi Mix Fold. While we are at a point uh, where folding phones are uh, no longer solely living in the realm of the impossible, they are still a rare sight to behold in the wild. The likes of Samsung, Huawei and Motorola have all unleashed contorting handsets and now it's Xiaomi's turn. The Mi Mix Fold is the company's first entry into the folding smartphone arena and uh, it is a beauty. The top spec model costs 11,000 yuan and uh, it's around US dollars 1700 or uh, 1220 British pounds or uh, 2190 Australian dollars, which is knitted out with an impressive 13 GB RAM and 512 GB storage. The real story, if we talk about the real story, though, is the gigantic 8.01 inch 1860 by 2480 foldable display which packs a 60 hazards refresh rate 900 nits of brightness and hdr 10 plus and dolby vision to boot it transforms the handset from a regular phone to a veritable tablet in an instant and uh, it looks like it can uh, comfortably give the likes of the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 2 a run for its money. When folded for protection, the Mi Mix Fold serves up a separate flash gap worthy 6.5 inch 840 by 2520 display on the outside, complete with pouch hole camera for easier selfies. Throw in a groundbreaking liquid lens camera which uh, changes shape to offer anywhere from uh, 3 times optical to 30 hybrid zoom a massive 5020 mAh battery and a beefy snapdragon 888 processor and we have ourselves one of the best phones on the planet it is a massive shame then that there are no confirmed plans for it to leave China and this is the only reason we have included this phone at the number one in the list of the top five smartphones Android phones that you can't buy now we come to the second number and it is Techno Spark 7P so guys business at the front party at the back says the official marketing material for the Techno Spark 7 it is not wrong from the front, it resembles any other modern handset with the only visible flare being the rather attractive centered selfie cam teardrop cutout. Flip it round though and your eyes will be seared by a combination of bright fluorescent, two-tone acid green and blue colors. It comes in more muted options of course, but uh, where is the fun in that? Launching in selected countries including India, Kenya and South Africa. It is expected to be priced around Rs. 11,600 that is around $1.160 or uh, uh, British pounds 110 or Australian dollars 450. At this price it is clearly not going toe to toe with the likes of iPhones, Galaxies and others but it appears to offer superb bang for buck specs in an eye-catching design that most other phones will be more than a little jealous of. So in this list at number 3 is Vivo V20 Pro. At the time of its launch, the Vivo V20 Pro was said to be the thinnest 5G smartphone in the world, measuring in a Swelte 7.38mm thin. It practically disappears when viewed from the site. We are not guaranteeing you could cut a cake with it, of course, but uh, in all honesty, you probably could, should you feel compelled to. Think profile aside, it is not a bad looking handset either, especially in the mate glass sunset uh, melody finish. 
which rocks a rather outrun SQ 80s blue pink color combo a mid range affair it has a snapdragon 720g processor 8gb of ram and 120gb of storage and a 4000 mah battery and a respectable if not record breaking 33w charging around the front you will find a 6.44 inch full hd screen complete with the teardrop selfie cam cut out which houses a pixel packing 44m camera with eye auto focus that is also capable of 4k selfie videos chuck in a 64 megapixel rear camera which promises detailed night shot along with 8 megapixel wide angle and 2 megapixel macro affairs and you have got a lot of fun for your money speaking of which the jazzy sunset melody version can be snapped up in india for rupees 25990 that is around dollar 350 or pounds 250 or australian dollars 200 in this list at number 4 is sharp echos sense 5g at first glance sharp's echos scene 5g might not seem all that remarkable beyond the fact that it is only available in japan that is take a little longer to dive into things thou and it begins to reveal a few interesting quirks pastel fans for starters are likely to love the muted pink and blue color options which are hues rarely seen on this side of the world understated design aside the screen is probably the next most interesting thing about the sense 5g while it is 5.8 inch size and 1080 by 2080 resolution might not seem like much it is the fact that uh, it's specially designed to work in bath that has drawn our attention while waterproof smartphones are a dime a dozen these days we haven't come across many that all accurately register swipes and uh, touches in a downpour most of the time a wet screen causes everything to do haywire forcing you to wipe it dry and try again the sense 5g on the other hand promises to not only shrug off water but uh, remain responsive accurate and operational even when the screen is wet bath lovers will be disappointed to hear that it is only available in japan a big shock and it's available in japan for 39600 japanese yen and that is around dollar 360 american dollars british pound 260 and australian dollars 470 and in this list uh, at number 5 is infinix 08 From behind the Infinix 08 is one of the most attention grabbing handset you are likely to see thanks to its rear camera setup's diamond formation complete with the matching two tone angular paint job while you would think the simple rotation of a square camera setup could have easily been achieved by any company this is the first one we have seen actually do it So bonus points for managing to breathe the new life into a tried and tested but generally boring aspect of smartphone design. The rear camera setup has a 64 megapixel plus 48 megapixel ultra wide camera capable of capturing shots in raw for in-depth tweaking. The front camera promises to impress too consisting of a 48 megapixel plus 8 megapixel setup. enabling you to take ultra wide and ultra wide angle selfie in darker conditions powered by a Helio G90T processor a 4500 mAh battery liquid cooling for lower temperatures when gaming and a generous 6.85 inch 90 hazard screen it is not too shabby on the specs front either it wins extra points for its bright color options which make the rear stand out even more it can be snapped up in nigeria for 116900 nigerian currency that is equal to around 300 us dollars or 220 british pounds or 395 australian dollars so guys these were the five of the best android phones you can't buy 
whether it was because of the location or some other problems so you have gone through the video so thanks for watching the video till end now i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye